so guys welcome to my youtube channel at uh, fellow the boy and uh, guys in case you are new to this channel and you have not subscribed to my youtube channel please consider by uh, checking it out and uh, subscribe to uh, fellow the boy youtube channel right to 7000 subscribers so i'm just uh, today's video uh, will be about uh, uh, one of the, the child who has been uh, having a problem and uh, by good luck is that uh, uh, this child uh, he has uh, received uh, a savior somebody who is going to somebody who has saved him uh, one of the subscriber and uh, this is the the child to one of the doctor who is and the, the doctor who took care of me when I was uh, uh, I was sick and also he has been taking care of uh, the rest of the youtubers who have been getting uh, uh, some health conditions huh? so he's the he goes by the name of uh, uh, Gidi and straight away from here I will be heading to his home no no his place where he works first so from uh, from there I shall be able to go and uh, give him uh, this kind of uh, gift that came from uh, one of the subscriber of which uh, he has been uh, communicating with this subscriber after I linked him up on the channel and uh, he was watched and got the subscribers. He's also uh, the same guy who went to uh, the same guy who went to visit uh, uh, one of the YouTubers in the village when he was having also a problem and he treated him very well. So I will be from here I will be heading there. Uh, I have got that uh, gift in my on my my boy's call outside i want just to start uh, the journey from here to go there but uh before that i want just to update you at least uh, on the ongoing work here before uh, before we go uh, i'm going to have at least uh, show you and i've realized that we have got also some of the new subscribers uh, who have subscribed to my youtube channel and they would like to know where we started from and uh, where we are right now just in brief is that uh, uh, my name is uh, Fellow the Boy. I have got a YouTube channel. You can check it out and, and subscribe. Uh, this is uh, my home that uh, I got from uh, our subscribers. Uh, I got, I got uh, through the support and the help of the subscribers and also from the something that I was trying to save little by little. And after getting this land, I, I started construction of the... We started molding the bricks. Uh, from there, we started uh, uh, constructing the toilet. Uh, we came up to do now the construction of the storage room. From there, we started constructing the house. From there, we started we, we constructed also the wall. And up to where we are right now, we are still uh, going on with the uh, work of the ceiling. So right now here, uh, we are uh, in the... First, I would like maybe to go and show you in the master bedroom because uh, uh, the master bedroom, as we are speaking right now, it has been completed being skimmed not like here but uh, it has been completed so be with me as we walk uh, slowly by slowly i show you uh, how the the house looks like so the new subscribers this is now the our dream house that we normally talk about and i thank god that uh, most of the subscribers they gave us the name of this house that we can call it because i've been seeing most of the people they mention they mention uh, they uh, they mention their houses the names huh? wow okay somebody was telling me on the comment section that uh, fellow the boy i'm happy with you i like watching your videos because you don't uh, i haven't seen in any of your title of the videos using the word maro you see what he was trying to say is that uh, most of the youtubers they like using uh, Marwa's name so that maybe they can get views or they can get the platform or the audience because everything, everything, I am Marwa, I am Marwa. So they are, he was trying to tell me that uh, uh, I am happy with you because uh, you, have, uh, you are standing on your own. You have never used this guy's name because uh, uh, some of them, they use his name so that they can be able to get the views. But with me, he said that this is something that I'm saying, something that somebody said, 
and uh, maybe he will have to defend it to defend me from the comment section that is the one who said it it's only that i cannot be remembered the name but uh, i saw that kind of comment so uh, the master bedroom you can check on it it has already been uh, finished maybe you can check it from here so this one remember the master bedroom we are not going to uh, to fix any decoration something like uh, a flower no in the master bedroom we said that we don't want that so it is going to be that way we are not going also to have the snake lights here the one that are lights uh, this way we are not going to fix that we are just going only to have uh, we are going to have only I think it is going to be one. We are just going maybe to have only one. The one that will be here. And already we have got those, those lights. There is a, um, one of uh, my sisters, she has already sent me the bulbs that we are going to use in the rooms. So I don't have nothing to worry with that. We have got already the sink of the kitchen. We have already I have it. We have got some of the showers. Okay, somebody was telling me that uh, your house is going to be very unique. Because you have uh, used the expensive stuffs. For real, I'm not bragging, but the, my house is going to be unique. No matter how it's going to be, it is unique. Even right now, it is unique. I'm proud of it. So everything that happened here, everything that we do, we are, pride, we are, we are proud of, of that. Huh? So guys, we'll be heading to uh, this doctor called Man, Mangidi, uh, right away from here. So that uh, I can go and uh, give him his, uh, uh, his gift. He requested me that uh, I would like you to come at this time because I will be now around in the hospital. So right now it is, uh, let us check what is the time. It is 2.30. Right now it is 2.30. 2.30 p.m. So I'm supposed to head there now. So let us go. The dining, they are still working on the dining room because uh, uh, it had some, some work. That's why you are seeing uh, they have not uh, gone very quickly because of the flower that you are seeing here. So they are trying to, they, they are still skimming it. All of the place you're supposed to look like this one, huh? the one that you are seeing here. So this one has already uh, been uh, skimmed, this part. This part, they are now uh, dealing with it. Huh? You know, now when you you skim, you also have to you also have to apply the fiber tape, the fiber tape as you are, as as you go. Maybe for those one, uh, we are talking about this one. We are talking about this, the fiber tape. So this one is whereby you 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 apply whereby we have got the joining, a place where, whereby they used to join. You apply this one using the gypsum powder so that uh, it can fill. It is like uh, it is filling. You can't be able to see that uh, that crack. You see, like here, like in this case, here they applied the fiber tape using the gypsum powder so that it can be uh, very nice. So he's still going on with the work here uh, by decoration, decorating it very well. At least we can have to. I think this is the last place whereby when they finish now, they start applying now the cornice. The cornice are here. This one that you are seeing here, uh, they are going to be applied now uh, on these places that uh, you are seeing here. All around the house, we are going to apply that and they will be starting with the living room to make sure that uh, it has been done. So when they finish, we can now uh, go on the other rooms. Huh? Okay, I had also gone to go and uh, check on the fertilizer because it is very important. You know, I have got uh, some of the the maize that I had. Uh, I have it somewhere, and I had to go and uh, confirm the fertilizer. Mm. So this one, the things they are just uh, working in the compound. They are just working in the compound, so I'll have to use this gate. Yeah, we'll have to use this gate because I don't want. I don't want them to follow me on the other side. I don't want them to, to to use to go to the other side. I want them to be in this area, you see? Yeah, so that they can be able to maneuver here, eating grasses. So I'll use this gate. So guys, please, please check it out. 
and subscribe to follow the boy channel road to 7000 we are moving to 7000 and uh, they are still subscribing they are going on with the subscribing because uh, each and every day we find that we have added some subscribers huh? oh so my brother was having here the vegetables but uh, i feel like maybe they have destroyed them it's like they have uh, destroyed them because uh, they are not growing now oh i'm supposed to use this root i have forgotten <laughs> i had forgotten that uh, that's not the place that i wanted to pass i wanted to pass here life has changed life has really changed every day every time each and every day we wake up things change this is whereby we have got the bees the bees and they are uh, they are not here I, I i think they gone they went they used to be here they were very 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 harsh i was watching a video of this guy called uh getangita <laughs> he was totally lost on with uh the bees so they bite him i saw people telling him that oh they bite they don't sting they bite so we wish him quick recovery yeah so the owner of this land he decided just to use chemicals to kill the grass so let us go we are just walking my motorbike is on the other end the other side so i'm just moving very well slowly by slowly i go and pick it then we start the journey to go to the doctor the hospital huh? oh something has gone out, has got some goose there i have heard the voice the sound of the goose you see guys this maze now after after they have destroyed the grass this is what happens now this land they never plowed it they never plowed it they just uh, killed the grass and they just planted the the cornies the cones i mean that way without plowing i see like it is a best method for example if you have got a very big of land you can use the, that mes me method eh? because it will just uh, give you easy time and uh, you just now apply the you'll just apply the fertilizer now without having any stray without uh, getting any problem yeah. so i need to go i need to go right now i don't know why this guy so there is a uh, this uh this guy called uh mangera he's a uh, you want to talk to me yeah what's on oh ah so i don't know i'm saying you're not going to rush you go for doctor yeah So today, today I will give you opportunity to speak, to speak, to, to say hi to my my audience. How are you? So guys, this is uh, one of the uh, the former leader. We can use the former leader. Is a uh, is a uh, uh, also like a parent to us. He has been uh, advising us about life. He has been educating us, uh, you as we as youth, on how to pursue in life, on how we can tackle uh, about. Uh, uh, the progress of the everything that we are doing so maybe i can give you opportunity at least to introduce yourself to the camera so that they can be able at least to hear you when yeah i'm john mangira yes former principal of Kube secondary school yeah and the former not executive secretary yes uh the entire Korea. okay so I've, I've retired i'm at home you are at home right and now i'm at home but yeah. we do it you are a widow you have been uh, I've been meeting you several times. Yeah, you have been telling me. <laughs> uh, I moved in and opened several schools around. Yes. Yeah, I'm in primary school. Yeah. 1986. Okay. 1986. Yeah. Uh, Kiburanga Primary School. Yes. Then 1992, I moved down after moving from Zibani High School. Yes. As a head of department. Yeah. 
I went to Kube and opened uh, Kube Secondary Kube School Secondary in school. 1992. Yeah. While I was there, then I moved on, uh, and then I opened, I organized members of the community and opened the West Kobe Primary School. Yes. Which is a well performing school in, uh, in, in Nyabuhans. In Nyabuhans, yeah. And in the division and in the sub county. Yeah. So I've been doing that. Apart from that, I have several students that. Uh, with my little pension, yeah, I'm also supporting. You are also supporting in, in them. Education. Yeah. Yeah. I have several about twenty-six now. Yeah, twenty-six students. Yeah, twenty-six students. Wow, you have got uh, actually you you have got uh, your name is great. You oh, have uh, yeah. Only that uh, the resources. Yeah. You have so come so scarce. So they say that even my students now. Yeah. yeah. Really, they they look more of the place with the others when. Yeah. Come to fee payment. They have not completed the fee here. The fee, fee payment. Here, here. Yeah. Fee, so how fee many how, how many of them they are in maybe in in, in high school or in they are, they are all in secondary school. Oh, they are in secondary uh, schools. Right now, I have four. I have four in uh, form four. We are doing examination this yeah. year. Yes. And the others are from form one to yeah. form two, form three. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Actually, you are doing a good job, sir, and uh, just uh, volunteering to use your pension. At least to stand up with uh, to support education in the community, yeah. you know this is something that uh, maybe even even nowadays we can't depend on the government because uh, it is not the way it used to be long time. Right now things have changed. We have got uh, we used to have things like bursaries, but nowadays the bursaries even you cannot be able to be hundred sure that you are going to get it. If but it's not, I mean, you can't get. And apart yeah. from that, you see the government say that uh, education is free. Yeah, education is not free. Yes, yeah, education is free. Down here, the parents are hard pressed. Yeah. With school fees, even primary schools. Yes, yes, See? that's true. We don't want children kicked out of school. Yes. And all that the parents are yeah. bring money for. Yeah. Teachers. Each and every time they send to be sent home. Send yeah. All over. You know, at times we I, I get really provoked about what it was. That's do. true. That's true. Yeah. So you just have to you just tolerate it and uh, act as a parent because uh, there is nothing you can do. And uh, they need that uh, that education so that in future they can help themselves. That's the thing. Yeah, you are just doing something very important in the community for real. You know, it's not very easy to find somebody uh, who's uh, using his money to help people. It's not very easy because most of the people they have been. Uh, we have got uh, how many leaders do you have in Kenya? There are a lot of them. They are so selfish. They are so selfish. Yeah. We have got uh, so many people who are rich. Give the rich to yeah. give in to the rich yeah That's the, the rich are giving to the rich yeah. and uh those one who have come from indigent families when they go for example they want to meet those uh rich people they cannot reach them they, cannot reach them. they yeah. be locked from away they just uh they, they be told that oh he's not around he has just uh, the mp or the mwishimiwa he's not around he has left they say, well, yeah. you are whose son who yeah who that's the question that they ask yeah whom do you know here? Yeah, the, the, the kind the, of the questions. The honorable member of parliament or the honorable member of the MCA is yeah. not around. Yeah, yeah. While he's in, inside. <laughs> he's just inside and they are being told that he's not around. You know, they have got the CCTV, so they just watch on their gates. Yeah. So if there is somebody that's came that they know, they, they just communicate to the security. They say, oh, let, let that one in. But so, like when I go, they say, <laughs> they see me from the road. Yeah, with you, they can allow you <laughs> in. That yeah. Is yeah. Tell him there. Let him see me on Monday. On Monday now. On Monday is, is when he's supposed to be in the road. Ah, you see now. Okay, guys. So this is uh, uh Mr. Mangera himself, and uh, he wanted to see me. I said that. Oh, let me pay him a respect, uh, attention, so that I can be able to listen for him before I proceed. Because uh, uh, to me, I give him uh, my own high level of respect, uh, uh, because uh, he's uh, the leader, and also right now we still need him as a parent and also as an advisor so maybe i will have to cut this video so that we can be able to talk with him but uh, one day one time i'll organize a day we shall just do a whole video on his home he will maybe give us uh, his stories uh, we can be able to go and visit him he can be able to share with us with the youths who are watching the videos so that they can be get some educative uh, uh, advice and educative uh, models from uh, mr mangera thank you very much guys so guys, I have reached here at um, Samwema Medical uh, Center and I can see this is the echo is just here. Uh, he has parked here. I have got uh, my motorbike here with uh, the gift. Maybe I will have to 
remove the gift from the motorbike first like I, uh, so that uh, when I enter inside you find that I have it I think we'll have to use this vehicle we'll have to use this vehicle because uh, the motorbike will be a little bit expensive a uh, little bit uh, hectic time so that even if it rains we cannot be able to get any problem so let us uh, do this way I'm just uh, trying to put it well, this blood. Okay, so this is the package, but uh, I'm sorry, I will not be able to show the name of the center. But this is the Felix Mokabwa, this is my name here, and uh, Dr. Gideon. So. Let us go inside. You don't know even uh, I'm coming. It will just be like a, a surprise. Samwema. Mangidi. How are you? I'm inside your store. So guys, he's attending the, the, the patient. I think I'll have to wait a bit. Before, uh, before you finish, so after you have finished, you will be able to come back. But I've already reached in the. This is the dispensing room, and uh, that's the place where we have got the medicine. I see we don't have medicine. I don't know what's the problem. Maybe he will be able to narrate for us. So let us wait. Okay, so he was. Uh, she was attending the. He was attending the patient. Huh? So we are just uh, here. Inside uh, his dispenser, is it dispenser or okay? I can call it an hospital. It's just a medical clinic. It's just a medical clinic. Yeah. And uh, this is his office. We are just uh, uh, ushering in and yes. uh, we are meeting him here. So, this, this is a big surprise. Yeah, how are you? I'm okay, and you? And I'm fine. Pleasure to see you. How are you doing? I'm okay. It has been long? Yes, I've been since long. Since I came here? Yes. Uh, and also, it has been long also meeting with you. Okay. But uh, we thank God that uh, we are still alive and we are breathing. That's the main thing that God has given us for free. Thank and you. we have to appreciate him a lot. Yes. So today is a blessed day uh, to you and also to me because uh, we have met in a style. Yes. And uh, meeting today is very important Just because opposite. somebody uh, will smile somewhere. Somebody will uh, have to laugh somewhere and God will also feel good. So we have got um, one of the subscribers. Guys uh, who has been uh, who used to who, who used to watch my videos, and now it came to happen that I did a video with uh, my brother here, Mangidi. Uh, you still have the YouTube channel, huh? Yes. Mangidi, and uh, when I came and did a video here when I was sick, uh, uh, this subscriber came to know him. So they have been communicating, uh, knowing each other, how they are doing, how everything is going on. By good luck, uh, this subscriber was very happy and uh, interested uh, about his work that he's doing yeah. and uh, he decided to give him something as a gift and this gift uh, has uh, been transported or uh, came all the way from USA uh, into Kenya so it has landed into Kenya but this gift uh, uh, Mangidi knows about it maybe he will give us the explanation about it but before that I will have to give him first so that he can start giving out info information about it when already he has it in his hands so it is my time now yes. uh, to give you a gift and uh, you receive it uh, i thank god for this yeah thanks to jesus so this is a, a gift guys it will be I, I don't know if we'll unbox it here or somewhere else but we'll be knowing what is inside and uh, what is inside he knows it and he knows it the, he knows its work very well yes so we are here with him and don't go away just subscribe on his youtube channel at mangidi check on mangidi one mangidi doctor. one yes. doctor he's a doctor actually he's a professional doctor the way you are seeing him this way he has saved so many people's life and also here when i arrived inside you found we had some patients who are waiting on the bench there so that means that uh, uh, he's giving them a uh, good uh, medical uh, medical checkup and also everything so yes, just a brief uh, 
we can uh, have just a brief yes the only thing that we don't want to to show people yes. where, where, is, where is the bio do you have a pen yes i have it Let's yeah see, maybe we can uh, rub the name of the center huh? yeah because sometimes some people like to be private huh? yeah yeah they don't want their name to be to be seen mostly yes so so that uh, when we are uh, putting the camera there we find that the name cannot be seen okay yeah so you can maybe yeah this is just a uh, just a uh, very brief history about this equipment which is inside here yeah uh, i'm a family man yes i have four kids yes three boys yes one girl wow and among this uh, and uh, I have a wife also. Yes. Among the my family members, yeah. two are having this what we call chronic illness. Yeah. That's my wife and my husband, my youngest son. Yeah. And a lot I told him that boy, there is a gift which is coming for to you from USA. Yeah. And you are going to receive it. This is in fact what we call complex uh, uh, nephrisa. Yeah. Uh, it's used when the boy is having an attack. Yeah. I told my friend yeah. over the other side yes. that uh, my boy and my wife they are having this serious illness. Yes. And wherever I've tried to give all of those medications, yeah. they normally don't respond very fast. Yeah. So normally it forces me to go to other facilities yes. for neuralization. No, so that okay. they opened the chest yes and uh, for and also in that way they saved the life okay so when i requested to my friend he said yes well gideon i'm sending to you that in a machine which is traveling you yeah. which is making your family members to yeah. travel all along to, to other facilities in migori yeah, using a lot of money and uh, the fun part of this illness that is asthma normally it attacks them during the night okay. you know i get okay. hard times Traveling all of the night, and other kids, others are in school, others are very young. Yeah, you know, you leave the young kids at home. Yeah, and uh, now this is just a matter of saving life. This is a matter of saving life. Yeah, and so the, I told the boy, Yeah, uh, I think it's good that when we are going, we're going and uh, to open it before the boy, yeah, so that you can, so that be, he able can be able to sit. And, and he, I know you will be very happy. Yeah, the boy will be very happy. Yeah, and uh, this is uh, regards to my friend. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I like even the best word to thank you yeah. for this uh, pricing machine, yeah. which is going to assist in my family. Yeah, okay. Viewers for my family and for my clients, those ones who may have that uh, yeah. kind of attack, yes. I will assist them. Just to be helping yeah. them. Wow. This one is something which is very important, yeah. but uh, I'm requesting you that we go to my place and we just uh, uh, present this gift to the boy. Okay. If I can present it myself, you cannot see whether it's Yeah, that's true. It will be very glad. I will be very glad to meet her. And also, uh, the subscriber, the good subscriber friend who sent this, yes. he will be also be happy to see the reaction yeah, of your boy yes after he has seen this because this one is going to save his life yes and uh guys i was told that uh, these machines are not um it's not very easy to find them in those places yeah they are not because, uh, there is in also... fact in the, in the all of Migori county yeah even our county the faro yeah it's hard to find this in a pressing machine oh yeah it's very hard to find them here i don't know whether it's a negligence but uh it's what well, it's found in one facility in Migori. That's life care. Life care only. Only. It seems, so, does it mean that it is expensive or it it uh, or uh, operating it? Maybe. Mm, it's only that we have given just a pack to this kind of attacks, that asthmatic attacks. Yes. We, our management is not all that up to date. Yeah. That's why we don't have this. Uh, most of the facilities here, they, they don't, don't have. In fact, there was a time I witnessed somebody dying. Oh because my God! And she died. She was already around 48, 50 years. She died before my presence. I tried even to ask her using my car to at a facility. Yes. In fact, she died while she was in my car. Oh my Because God. why? We missed this machine. We missed this machine. Yeah. And she died. Oh, let me hope now, guys. God is going to save the rest using this machine. Uh, for the one who died, rest in peace, but. Uh, uh, God has stood up now with Kenya, uh, with our friend from US, uh, for saving uh, Dr. Gideon uh, to have this kind of machine, not only for his family, but also for the community and also the entire constituency. Because uh, when people will know that we have got this kind of the machine, they will be able to come and uh, 
uh, yeah. be treated here. And uh, we are praying also those one who are still watching this video, and you can also support Mangidi with anything because last time when I came here, he requested that uh, anybody who's watching this video, he can uh, support with the facility uh, because we have got uh, he's lacking the facilities uh, to save those people who are having the problem. Yeah. By good luck, we got one of our friends who has saved a uh, house with this Nebula machine. Yeah. So maybe apart from this one, this machine, is there any kind of machine maybe that? Uh, is urgent that you feel like maybe if you get it now uh, also you'll be better with it yeah. apart from this one now apart from this one yeah we have what we call the monitors okay the monitors these are the ones which take the vital signs yes and the indicators of this life i don't have any one yeah but uh, there's a friend of mine when we were just uh, presenting with some 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 few days yes he was assisted with one yeah you know the goodness of the current monitors yes they have even ecg machine yeah. attached to it yeah so that's one it can help the heart okay, you can show okay, okay. how the heart is functioning. how the heart is functioning yeah so that's one is also okay. very important yeah and even we need even just uh, the, the modern microscope for our oh, the the microscope. Let yeah, microscope investigations. Yeah. Okay. So those are the things. And there was a friend, in fact, some days back, who showed that he was so back. I think she was a lady. Kindly, wherever you are, I'm still waiting your response. Oh, yeah. Thank you. It's good that you promise you'll come, you will call, you come back to us. Yeah. We are still waiting for you. Okay. Yeah. Okay guys, so uh, thank you very much. From here we'll be heading at uh, his home. It will be also for the first time to meet to God your home yeah. because I haven't uh, visited you. But today God has been uh, with us. Today we are going to visit him, his home. So as we start the journey, let him just uh, serve the patient who are around. Then we shall be able to go. Thank you very much guys and God bless you. Thank you. So guys, we are heading to Mabera and we'll be using this, uh, this car for the doctor. We're just using this road, the tarmac road that heads to Mabera. We have just came from uh, his place uh, to the hospital, Msamwema Hospital. So we'll be going with it. Sir! <sighs> So this is a, a pro box a pro box car but it is a very nice uh, it is it, it also helps you for the like a, like your uh, uh, ambulance yes it's like your ambulance also. Yes, sometimes when you have uh, somebody is very critical yes and they need the alfaro yeah you can use this one for to, uh, to, to take someone yes it's just a pro box it's just a pro box guys you can check on it yeah God willing, if you God can open the way so you get an ambulance, the better. <laughs> I know one day, one time, yeah. we are going to get it. Yeah, yeah. there is much hope. Yes, the so hopes are there. We can, uh, can have one yeah. which is just equipped, yeah. an ambulance which is best equipped with the modern equipment. With the modern equipment. Yeah, to save the life. Yeah. So guys, this is there, we are heading to Mabera. And uh, we are just in this vehicle. Uh, this is just the road. You can check on beside most of the time. I just pass here using my motorbike, uh, just showing you some of the things. But when you are in the vehicle, you are just now seeing it very well. See? So it shows that uh, it's gonna rain any time. Right now, we have uh, experiencing a lot of rainfall. So once we reach in Mabera, I'll be able to uh, show you guys. Thank you very much. So guys, we are here in Mabera. We have already passed Mabera Market. Mabera Center, you have been uh, seeing those places. Huh? So there is a... This is a road that heads to Doctor's Place. There is a, a school here called Bridge. I don't know if it is still working. It's working. Oh, it is working here. It is a Bridge International Academy. You can check on it. That is uh, the schools that uh, were brought with uh, is an international school. They have been helping the students uh, a lot. So we are now heading to doctor's place. You can see there is a dog here. Now mine, which are very big. Oh, your dog. Huh? So this place I've already reached here, but I didn't know. I don't know your exact place. Yes, this is Mabera. Judy. Yeah. 
the neighbors guys in Africa you know neighbors uh, we greet each other each and every time yeah you will not by pass you can't pass without saying hi not that not it's not like in Nairobi Nairobi somebody is just on his own business so the road is somehow this stone but uh, we are just trying yeah. almost there yeah So we are almost to reach. Oh, it is here. On our right. Who's there? Yeah. This is my wife. Your wife was leaving, huh? So she is from the church. We have just a small. Oh, she has a church. Oh, you have got a function? Yeah, there is a function in the church. Oh. Yeah. Okay, guys. So we have got a function here. It is. Uh, it will be holding here at his home. No, it's not my home. Oh, this is not your home. Ah. So that's uh, Yeah, so they have to we're just heading there now guys. Jambo. So we are still going. So this place is very cool, huh? Yeah. Very cool. It's a good place to stay. This yeah. is my life. Now oh, this is your life. Not to put up, uh, Perimeter. Uh, even this one is beautiful. Yeah. This one is very beautiful. So guys, we have reached. Yeah. So he's going to uh, open the gate so that you can be able to uh, get in. Oh. Okay, oh, you park the vehicle, you go with the motorbike, huh? No. Okay. So this is your dog. It is hard. It, are they harsh? Mm, just huh? just you know, maybe they will like, oh, they, they may jump on me. No, 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 just <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, so this is... This is one of my dogs. This is one of your dogs. How yeah. does... Do they have names? Yeah, this is Simba. This is Simba. Yes. Then, uh... Tip him. Then the, that one is Tibim. Yes. <laughs> then we, we have got the others. Oh, this yeah, one. Oh, the, the one that is barking is now harsh. Yeah, eh? this is just a, this is a German Shepherd. Yeah. Yeah, this is a German Shepherd. This is Penavaro. The one that is here is a German Shepherd. Yeah. This is a Pope. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. It's called Ooh. Pope. It's called Pope. Yeah. Oh, they are very harsh. Mm. You have got a lot of them. Yeah, I have five. So d during at night you just open for them. Yeah, yeah. This is Pecky. Oh, this one you have said. What's the name of this Bob. one? Bob. Bob. Yes. And this one is Pecky. She's Pecky. a lady. Oh, this one. Oh, she's a lady. Yeah. And this one? This one is Plus. Hey. Yeah. I saw you got enough security. Yeah. You use a lot of food. Huh? Yeah. I use just a feeding lot. them. Yeah, just feeding them is enough food. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> hey guys, uh, today is a uh, day, guys. We have arrived here at uh, doctor's home. You have heard uh, the dogs, they are barking because they have seen a new face here. So uh, we have been told that uh, the child is not around. We just go to pick him. We come, then uh, we can be able to uh, yeah. do the what has brought us here. So we are just... Uh, we, we, yes, yes. We'll just be going with, uh, uh, with the... You just park, then uh, we go and pick the, the boy. So this is called Mabera, guys, for the new subscribers. I know, even even not only the new subscribers, for the subscribers, this is a doctor's home. This is doctor's home, so we'll be taking some rivers uh, with the vehicle, so that uh, we can just be able to go with it. We go and pick the boy. Oh, this place is very nice. Very, very, very nice. Look at the dogs. Oh, hey. So I think uh, one day, one time, I'll also have the same, same dogs, but they are very, very scary. Oh, so we have to go with the vehicle? Yeah. Okay. We'll just leave the gate open? Yeah. Okay. Nobody can enter here. Oh, nobody can enter here because ah, no. the dogs will have to <laughs> just chase him. <laughs> yes. German Shepherd, uh, we are going. <laughs> okay. So guys, let us go and take the, the, the child. So guys, we have already picked the boy. We are with him here. So we are just heading home. Uh, Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Just say hi. Yeah, good. Good, good, good. <laughs> so, once we reach home, we'll be able to 
test and to see how they work because uh, he will be very happy to receive it. So let us go. Yeah, so guys, we have arrived here at uh, a doctor's home and uh, this is uh, his house. We have just came with the vehicle. We have just parked it here and uh, this is now the living room. The, the entrance part, front elevation of the house. So we are just uh, getting in. We are just uh, we are with uh, the boy. We have got his motorbike has parked here, and uh, this one is the living room now, where he has uh, welcomed me in. And we have got the boy here. Uh, how are you? Fine. You are fine. So you can tell us your name. Alan Edson. Your name is Alan. Edson. Alan Edson. Okay, you are from church. You are you are you are you are you, you are from church, huh? guys. We find him. He was in church, so we have just uh, came with him so that uh, uh, his dad can be able to uh, show him the machine that we have. So we have got uh, the doctor. Yeah. He's here, and uh, he I can see he's having some of the medicines. Huh? In fact, when we were not able to have this uh, this machine we are having here. Yes. Uh, this is the boy. Yes. Yeah. Can you tell them your names? Alan Edson. Alan Edson. Bizuri. Eh? Sema? Alan Edson. Alan Gideon. Edson. Gideon. Eh? Yes. Yeah. Uh, this is the boy. Yes. My last born boy. Yeah. He was uh, when we when we had uh, no when we had when we were not able to have this machine here. Yeah. In fact, this boy has been under several. Uh, uh, in Harris, which yes. have been here, uh, this is in my house, yeah. and there are many more others which are not here. Yeah, he has been using all of this in Harris, as you can see. Yeah, so yeah. this one, has, uh, one yeah. that, uh, he has this been one has been using this one. Yeah. This one is best for prevention. Okay. We used to give this one to prevent for an attack, yes. which comes, and this one, Salpitamo, is also good. But it's the best which we, this one you use it when there is an attack. Yes. And this one is now more for original. Yes. And now fentanyl is the best. Fentanyl is the best now. In Hera, when yeah. it comes when there is an attack. Yes. Go together with other combinations. Yeah. Uh, there are other other antibiotics maybe be for any uh, bacterial infection. Yes. Yes. When you normally when it's having an attack, it means there is an infection, blood infection. Yeah. So we just manage it with uh, together with other antibiotics, yes, and uh, and, uh, and even some steroids. Those steroids are not recommended if you are for just management of uh, uh, asthma attack. Yeah, but uh, there are some cases uh, exceptions. We can call it uh, exceptions yes. where we give these uh, steroids. They yeah. work better also. They assist the boy. Yes. So he has been using all of these drugs. There are other other syrups which like ascolid, which used to open the chest, yeah. uh, so that the boy can get an easy uh, best way of just bleeding. Okay. So in fact, this boy has been under this medication yes. for many 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 years. He's now oh. turning seven years. But now it's seven years. Huh? Yeah. It's when did he start having this the kind of problem? When he was three years. When he was three years, he started yeah. having the problem. So that's around four years now. Four years now, yeah. he has been uh, hospitalized. Yes. In fact, he has been a regular visitor to Life Care Hospital, yeah. which is at Migori. Yes. Uh, they have been, uh, this boy has been there for a number of days. Yes. Uh, years, they have been assisting the boy. Okay. I don't want to say they have really been they assisting really assisted, the boy. Yes. Because they had this machine with the pressing yes, machine. Yeah, yeah. And we are going to open it so that we can be able to see. Yeah. Uh, and we hand it over to the boy yes. so that he can be able to see. Okay, so yeah. guys, it's the time to open. We have got the, some of the explanation uh, from uh, uh, the doctor. And uh, according to how you have heard him, the boy has having a problem for four years now. And uh, this problem has been uh, very, 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 very hectic to him. He, he used to travel to Migori. From here to Migori, guys, is around six kilometers, six to seven kilometers. And uh, you have to use uh, transportation to go there. You have also to go and uh, pay because life care is not a. Is it a government hospital? No, it's a private. It's a facility. private hospital, and you have to pay and it's very for any service, and it's very expensive. Mm -hmm. But today, the gift uh, from America has uh, arrived here in this country and is helping, uh, is going to help uh, 
uh, Edson Gideon uh, very 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 well and tonight now we are now unboxing it so that uh, we can be able to see it very 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 well so it's trying to open it you now they normally wrap it very well so that uh, they cannot be tampered with yeah tampered with this you have got to you know some when they, they travel here and there so that somebody cannot be able to tamper with it yeah so we have got uh, the box inside yeah the first the box. box is here yeah and this one is the second box now yeah this is the second box so this is yeah. a nebula laser nebulizer compressor machine. compressor, compressor nebulizer, nebulizer. Yeah. It is supposed to be connected to the electricity. Okay. But so uh, in our area here, we are having an issue with the with power. power. Yeah. Uh, there is a lot of power. Yes. And currently, I'm using just uh, the solar. The solar, yes. which cannot be able good for us to test what this ones. Maybe it takes a lot of power. Yeah, it takes a lot. Of, it must be an electricity. Yes. This one is just the cup, uh, which used to, to do the connect. Yes. Oh, so yeah. they are just uh, dis they assembled them. Yeah, so they assembled them. It, it, everything is is together now. This is what we call the compressor. Yes. This is what uh, this is now really the real machine. This one is now the real machine. Yeah, this one is the real machine. Yes. And you can have it, boy. So receive it. <laughs> okay, guys. So he's receiving now the machine. Yeah. We have already uh, unboxed them. Yeah. From the from the box. And uh, it's going to help. Look, look at the camera. Look. Yeah. So this is a. Uh, how do you feel now? You have got something that is going to help you. Same good. You feel good. Huh? Yeah. So this is uh, one of uh, our subscribers, who's a friend to your dad, or also to me. He said that at least uh, he would like to save your life because uh, he has been. Uh, you have been getting a lot of hard time to go and uh, find where these machines are, and today you are you are having it now in your house. Huh? You are so you are going to be using it okay guys so that is it this is the boy and the boy has uh, received the machine the machine that will help him. okay so we have got also this one. these cups this one now is for the boy the younger boy oh, this one is you for the young like boy these ones yes yeah and this is for this young boy and this one is for the mother because even the her mother oh, the, the mother also has got the problem yes the same problem yes so this ones they are going to assist us so much uh, in fact, uh, these ones we are going to put them with electricity. Soon it will be. When so the electricity will be fixed. Yeah. Okay, guys. The mother is not around. She has gone to church. They have got uh, some Function. functions there. So we are not uh, been able to get her here. But next time we, when we come, I know she will be around. Because uh, when the electricity will be come, we shall have to come and test the machine now. Yeah. On the camera, we see how it is working. Uh, when we have got power, so the machine has already been received. Yeah. Bro, with the uh, the boys here. Yeah. And what are the, what are these one? This one are for. This one is the cups where we where we just put it the drug. Yes. Now the drug is just put inside here. Yes. And uh, just it it's connected. When the electricity will come, I you will connect it and we will just understand everything. So that you will see how it best it works. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay, guys, so that is it. Uh, for the guys, for anybody who did this, may God bless you a lot for this help because uh, uh, you have really saved this family, the entire family, and also the. Yeah, Angalia camera. Sema, thank you very much. Hi. Sema, thank you very much. Thank you very much, uh, Grandpa. Sema. Sema, thank you very much, Grandpa. Thank you very much, Grandpa. Grandpa, eh? Okay, he's a grandpa to you now because he's yeah. uh, he's old school. Yeah. But uh, for uh, for us, he's like our brother. Mm -hmm. So this this machine is going to help you a lot. Huh? This one is a nebulizer machine, in, a machine mm -hmm. that uh, is a compressor in a blazer that will be help you now. That's how I'm talking about my gold. Do you? Yeah, my gold. I'm talking about my gold. Hey, when you don't know how easy it's going to be, that's how I'm talking about my yeah, so that is it, guys. We are very happy about that, no, and this is uh, this is something that uh, uh, we are praying for whoever did this, so that God will be able to bless him, and uh, he cannot be able so to lack because for having that kind of heart to come and save a, a child in Kenya, a boy like this one, is not something very easy. So this uh, this one traveled uh, from US to here using an airplane. So thank you very much, guys.
from here we shall be going out uh, my brother will be also showing us a, a certain project that he is having so we need to get maybe some explanation uh, about uh, there is something he want to he want, he wanted to talk to me we see on how uh, it is working uh, you know yeah we just come yes. this way yeah uh, this is just uh, my compound yeah Na, but uh, in uh, one or uh, one or another way yes we used to assist i uh, used to assist uh, the community the community yeah. when it comes to dry season yeah people walk here very far yes to, fetch for to go and water. fetch water yeah yes so i decided to just uh, dig a chest a pothole yeah and i've tried to cement it you yeah. can come and see so you you did this because people used to go very yeah. far to fetch water if you come here in the evening today in the evening yeah later we'll, you will see people we'll find a lot of them here yeah many people will come over to this place yes this one is just the one which is assisting them for to fetch here uh, you know it's 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 big it's here so I it is here this one here i use some cash here to just build this one there's a lot of water inside here so let me ask you yes. why did you decide to put uh, two lids and we have got the bigger one yeah. or it depends with the container that you are using no the bigger one is meant for when you just we want to just clean inside yes somebody will not be able to pass through this small door so we open that big one it stays like that overnight so that uh, the, the oxygen, oxygen yeah can enter inside yes so that's yes the main resort. yeah and i put it around almost uh, to the way to the road here. near to the road here yeah, it's very it's very close to the road yes here. yes guys you have got the road here yeah and the so bohol is just here when people will come here yeah they come and fetch and they go so this is has been me giving a lot of headache because how best can i assist the community because so this, how deep is it it's around uh, 42 feet 42 yeah so just lifting water from down is a uh, hard uh, 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 it gives them hard time now it gives them a lot of work yes and the thing in the community many people here they are, they are not happy we can say yes yeah and the children are the ones i'm more concerned about the children yeah they are the ones who are sent to fetch water yes and they go very down, far very far like uh me. like one kilometer one and a half kilometer one and a half kilometer yeah. for somebody because having something on the head to better than it they go down deep kapisa yeah so it's very far from here yes uh, and this project is not complete as it is now it is still ongoing it's ongoing yeah that's why we are just tapping for anywhere we shall we don't need to just uh, something very complicated here yes just yes. a manual pump. just a manual pump yeah just yeah a for manual. for them to get yeah, water easily now without using here. a lot of uh, energy the way it is it's yeah. very risk yeah uh, the way it is now it's very risky because children can come and decide to pray over the other side uh, we, we never we cannot tell what will happen that's good that's true that's yeah, true so, so we try to save their life so that uh, we cannot lead to any danger yeah so if we can get it as just a manual pump there's just one which is how manual. much does it cost it's uh, like uh, together with all the equipment yes. they're going to be put inside yeah Love around 120,000. 120,000. Yes. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, That's 120,000. Uh, in fact, I've spent out of my own pocket how to wear it has leached because I was sending it loud from down for 42 feet. Oh, you started spend, uh, constructing the bricks, laying the bricks from down? Yes. Up to up so that they can have to get an, a clean water. Yes. Yes. It has just cost around uh, 200, 300,000. 300,000. Yes. Oh, that's a lot of After money. That's now, true because I understand. I know. I know. I know. I've been uh, I'm a Mason, so I understand how yeah. how expensive it is. So it is just where it has lived. It's only it's just, uh, just a pump. Yeah. We fix it and the problem will be over. There's a lot of water inside here. Okay. And it's, it's almost soft water, not hard water. So you have got the good plans for your community yes. and your society. As a doctor, yeah. you cannot tolerate something like that in the community or in the society because uh, uh you know you care about people yeah. and you understand very well uh how difficult it is carrying something on your head for a long distance maybe you as a doctor some of the you 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 knows maybe the signs that it will lead in future for example a boy like this one mm. or a small girl carrying water from far up to the to his home or her home he will get that uh, maybe in future is getting some problems maybe yeah. some standard growth problems mm. or some any co any any health condition so you as your doctor you have decided to come up with this idea of having a bohol in this society 
so that uh, the people who are in this community they can be able to get the water very easily but uh, you are requesting for the well wishers anybody who will uh, volunteer and come and help you the way they have volunteered and helped the boy with yeah, the so. embraza compressor yeah. machine yeah. and uh, if we can get that uh, uh, that pump it is just pump guys it's a yeah, pump it's that you pump manual. this way a manual one just a manual. yeah you just pump the water actually the water you will use a few minutes to get water yeah. compared to this one this one you have to wait for it to fetch water inside you have to start lifting it with using a lot of energy and think about uh, you need to go to you need maybe to go and uh, fill up something like uh, 100 liters yeah you will, uh, you know, you see, you will, you will, will not, abuse will not be, Somebody will not be able, just around 10 liters. Yeah. That is the maximum somebody can be able easily pull it from down. From down. Yeah. Yeah, I but uh, 42, 42 is very it's long. It's very far. Yeah, very 42, far. I understand, is very, it needs a pump for yeah. it. Yeah. So this is my compound. This is my house for the dogs here. And the things are good here. And Guys, you can see the house of the dog on the... And actually, you had a, 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 a great thought for thing putting a house of the dog near to the gate. Yeah, for security reasons. For reason. security reasons. Yes. Because uh, once anybody enters here, My gate and is you know, the, something something fun is that uh, when you are coming, you are new, yeah. you will not realize that uh, <laughs> we have got this house here. <laughs> but uh, the sounds of the barking, they will just uh, yeah. uh, show you that we have got something. You know here, yeah. this tree, they are always inside. Yes. And the two, they are outside here for features. Oh, the two are just uh, outside. Yeah, the, the but, but they are always there. Yeah, for vigilance. Yes, they just take care of this compound when we are away. Yeah. So I love the dogs because they are obedient. How much do you spend per week just feeding them? Uh, feeding them per week is just three thousand Kenyan shillings. Wow. Yeah, because if I can be able to employ somebody, two soldiers, I could have paid them a lot of money. You could have made them a lot of money and also yeah. give them food. Yeah. Yeah. And so you could have uh, used more than 20,000 shillings yeah. every month. But they are assisting me so much. You know, if you can help per month, that's around 12,000 per month for yeah. food if you use. And we have got some of the de vaccine. Maybe they have got some. These ones, they are vaccinated. There is a fair to use just in control of these ones. Yes. Because uh, it, you need to keep your dogs up to date because the vaccines and lepis the vaccines yes. they have been received them yeah up to next year february yes yeah up to the next year february have, is when you have a dog to... here is having its own card yes yeah okay. so for just a four up okay guys so that is it that is and it that's my it gate so, is here. so you bought you bought them while they are still young yes or, uh, i bought them uh, they, they were this one it was the pig oh the, the first others, one yeah the others this popel was yeah. around uh I put it around uh, 75,000. Seven, 75,000 Kenyan shillings? Yes. Wow. Yes. A lot of money, guys. Yeah. 75,000 Kenyan shillings, guys. Yeah. Those two others. That's around uh, $600. Yeah. <laughs> the others, too, this one. Uh, this one. Yeah. It, uh, I put them at around uh, 15 each. They were three months. That's 30,000. Yeah. So, 30, if you add to seven, that's one of 5,000 shillings. Yeah. Oh, so, guys, you can imagine that a thousand USD on the dogs. I love these ones. Yeah, I love the dogs. I love the cows also. These things they make me happy when I'm when here. When you see them, they're inside yeah. the compound. The dogs they are full. They are full, <laughs> full of love. You yeah. feel like oh, and yeah. you know something that I've realized when we came the first time they barked. Yeah. But when we have came back now, yeah. they have not barked. Now they have all seen oh this guy is good. Mm. He don't want. <laughs> he don't have the, any any yeah, bad intention over I this think compound. I can open them. Mm. They can change. This one is so big. It's big. So this one, uh, let me ask. Yeah. Now that uh, you have got this compound, yeah. When you open them at night, yeah. Somebody, there's somebody pass here on the road. Uh, I have discipline these dogs. Yes. Because they are they are disciplined enough. Oh. Yes. They are not concerned with anybody who is outside this compound. Ah. Whatever they are here, you can see people are moving around here. This is oh. just away, but they are not concerned with anybody uh, outside. They are so they just they just take they, uh, they just take security inside the compound. Inside here yeah. only. Yes, you, you cannot even even if they know that the, the kind of the hands that have here, they know them. If a stranger hand comes here, they will kill it.
how, wait, uh, let me let me ask you did yes. you how how did you start training them you see you know something training something like a dog for that kind, no, having respect one, not to go outside the compound German shepherds yeah they are like the best dogs to be trained they okay, have, okay they are the highest even the police yes. the kenyan police here they use this these are one. the kind of the dogs they use ah, because of discipline for the discipline actually yeah. for security they know my hands which are outside here they cannot uh, mess up maybe they, uh, eating the even, uh, eating no, uh, the, no, no, the, no. the the chickens but <laughs> if a stranger come a stranger hand comes inside they will kill it oh so the neighbor hands cannot be able to intrude no. inside this the hands will not come inside here and they came did they come no they have never come. They have not come inside here. But if they come, if somebody is not there, they will kill it. They have mastered even everybody. Yeah. How do you operate it when you receive the visitors here? For example, a visitor who is uh, coming to stay here. So a visitor, when he comes, when yeah. he comes, yeah. normally we, when we are feeding them, yeah. he trains us. Oh, yeah, he joins you when you are feeding him. When, when it comes, so that you can be familiar with them. Our team with my boys here, we yeah. just uh, team up when we are feeding this one. One person cannot be able. So when we are feeding them, if they, we have a feaster here, we just make him to familiarize with the dogs here. How long does it take so that it so can be able to be familiar with it? I've told you that German Shepherds are well disciplined dogs. So, they so take like just one or two days. Oh, That's enough, yes. One or two days, guys. They have known they are, this is a fish they are this friends. Compound, they will not mess with you. Next time I'll come with the meat. Yeah. <laughs> they, ca they can have, have yeah, allow no, meat no, from they, the stranger. They will not. Oh, they will not eat? Yeah, no, 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 no. They will not. <laughs> hey, hey, this one I've been trained. <laughs> yeah. Guys, that's a good lesson, guys. It has been good to be with him here. Yeah. We have learned a lot. Actually, you know, uh, we didn't know even about the dogs. We didn't know even about uh, the, the rest of the, the story about them. But uh, right now, I know everything is okay. But, like but the popel, yes. it comes, this one comes from South Africa. Popel comes from South Africa? Yeah, originally from South Africa. Eh? This one is very powerful. I'm shocked with the price. Yeah, wow. it's very, no, that's a friendly price again. <laughs> <laughs> friendly price, 75,000 yes, Kenyan shillings. Let me know. Price. How much does yours cost? If mm. you're watching this video, you can yeah. tell me in the comment section if you've got the dog. If you how much does the, it cost? Just the pure popper from South Africa, it's yes. 150,000. One. A puppy of 1,500, 1, 1,350 USD. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. hey. But they are very powerful. Very okay. energetic. Let me tell you, do you have something like a. Uh, uh, do, they, do they give birth? Do they? Yeah, I, the puppies, this one I told you is Becky. Yeah. She gives uh, the kids, uh, the, the, the puppies. Uh, yes. Normally you I sell them. So you sell them expensive? Yeah, no. Yeah. I'm very friendly to the community, I have told you. Yeah, that's when you true. have said it, like you are a friend, I know. I, 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 need, to, uh, I need, I need, yeah, I need. No, I'll give you one. I need actually when mm. the time comes when yeah. they are, we have got them. Yeah, you will just uh, I'll give you give one. Me one I so am that very friendly, you know. Oh. I bought these things very expensive that's from true, others that's because true. I was so you a can't, stranger. You can't also be able to revenge no. by treating us. A, I bought yeah. one puppy at fifteen thousand. Yes, but for me, I'm just taking. Somebody can take it at around five thousand. Five thousand yeah. shillings only. You see now, yeah. you are saving the community for security also. Yeah. Despite saving them in health, you're also saving them on yeah. also security you part. You're also saving them on the hygiene. Yeah. Yeah, they are, they're also getting water. Yeah. You see, I don't, actually a lot of things, guys. So that's what we are learning here. We have got also different varieties of uh, the cows here. This one is uh, the normal Kenyaji. No, you see, no, no, you see, no more. Yeah. This is a crossbreed. Oh, this one is a crossbreed. It is a crossbreed. Yes. The mother is pure Asha. Oh, pure Asha, their mom. Yeah. Where's their mom? Is this one? No, no, no. I bought it from oh, a friend. Oh, this one you bought because it from a friend. These cross breeds, yeah. they have high resistance oh. to diseases. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. High resistance for diseases, actually. Yeah. Okay. And this one is? This one is a. Uh, this one, the breed also comes from South Africa. Yes. Uh, this one is pure. That one is pure. Yeah, this one is pure. This I one is a Asha also. This one or is fresh. Asha. Yeah. The, this one is a Frisian. Frisian. The Asha is that one. That's it, this one. Yes. You, you have, do you have jersey? Jersey, jersey? no. You don't have jersey? I don't have jersey. Ah, okay, okay. So, so, this is just a small pool. Yes. I want to keep it to assist the community also for breeds. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. Uh, hey. I, I Actually, have, I can see yeah. you have got a mission in yeah, this community. We the, when the, the community and the village is full with uh, good things. Yes. You know this place, when it's uh, the pool, when I was just googling the pool, yeah. 
the father of these ones, it costed around 1,800,000 to just the Kenyans to import it from South Africa. Up to here? Yes, the pool, one. One million? Mi it's 1,800,000. That's almost uh, 200,000 to, yeah. to be 2 million. Yeah. Now. So, uh, they are good. I love this one because this is uh, a bit uh, combination of uh, Piwa and Kenyaj. Piwa and Kenyaj. It is yeah. a mix-up? Huh? It's a mix-up. Okay. A cross bleed. So do you feed them on your own or you, you, you have employed someone who normally uh, helps there's you? Somebody who takes care of them yeah. when I'm away. And yes. But when I'm here, yeah. I love doing this. You know, it is also enjoyable, some yeah. enjoyable during the weekends yeah. when you have not gone to work. And I normally saw you, uh, see you uh, carrying the Nepia grass even in your vehicle yeah, from Nyabuansi, yeah, yeah. from any place. And these vehicles are also a good help because, for example, imagine you have got a Nepia grass somewhere like Hispania. Yeah. Transporting to this place it will be very expensive. I, now that you have got a car. I go very far for the Nepia grass, not, yeah. not around here. Yes. Very far. Very far. So which one right now do you milk? This, that one? That one. Yes. This one is expectant. Oh, this one is expectant, yes, yeah. right, right, yeah. right. So, so, yeah. So, right now, at least you don't use turungi. Ah, <laughs> strong tea, no. Strong tea, guys, is a tea without milk, the black one. So, she don't use it. Yeah. And uh, you have got actually a very nice portion of land. You know, yeah. it is a uh, standard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's I've like changed a, it also. Yeah, you have I've changed it. I changed it to organic. Uh, and I want to move out from this chemical farming. Yeah. I um, want to change. That's my kitchen garden. Your uh, kitchen garden is there. We use only organic manure. Organic manure only. That's organic manure which is down there. I'm preparing it for uh, for planting. I want to do away with this planting, uh, these fertilizers. They are selling as you can get all of those stories from the newspaper. They are, this is stones, whatever the case. Guys, we had a case in Kenya yeah. whereby uh, <laughs> the government uh, caught some of the bugs. Yeah. They have been mixed. You know what they do? Somebody forgot uh, one fertilizer sack. He, he has to get two from one. Yeah. So they come and collect sand. They, they put, mix they mix it with the, his fertilizer. You know, they are just the same in color. So when you you find them, you will not be able to differentiate. Yeah. And uh, that's why most of the people like Mangidi is saying that he better use this one I'm, I'm than chemical that. from the yeah. the aggravate or the cereal. I have my farm down here. Yeah. I use the pure this one. Use pure this one. Yeah. Actually, this one I normally hear that uh, it takes a lot of time in the land. Yeah. And it is very unique. It is fertility. This ones. Yeah. And even the uh, the health wise of the crops. Yes. The just the flower is very fast. Yeah. And uh, the the harvest also. I've done it. This is now my third time to charge just doing away with it, uh, the fertilizers, the fertilizers from, the shops. from the shops. Yeah. I'm using organic manure. Using that organic manure. Yeah. So these cows, they are assisting me. Plus the uh, hens, they are assisting me. Actually, you have arranged yourself. Yeah. You know? You're not there just uh, only depending on. Uh, and it, it is also a good lesson for, for us, the youth that we are growing, not only to depend on one thing. You have to venture to venture in a lot of uh, business. Huh? Yeah. Uh, not only one thing, because what about things that ask yourself, what about this, the one, something that I depend on, if it fails today, how will I survive? No, but at least you have got uh, the second thought. Mm, I wanted to move also to this improved Kienyech. Improved Kienyech, like this one now? Yeah, these ones are improved Kienyech. This one I know, uh, how much do you, uh, like this one can cost, one of it? One, one of, of it is 1,100. 1,100, wow! Yeah. There is a lot of money, 1,100. Mm -hmm. You can imagine, if you have got uh, this, this kind of business, you you buy them, you grow them, you sell. Yeah. You buy another one small, you start again that way. You That's a project of its own. Yeah. And even uh, even if it's organic manure, yes. it's easier at a time. When I have print, yeah. I sell it. You sell it also, yeah. yeah. And it's also expensive. Very expensive. Very expensive. When somebody comes for it, just one uh, pickup is around uh, 4,000. You see? Yeah. 4,000 and uh, that money also helps you to go and buy the food for the cows. Yeah. Mm. Okay, guys, I think uh, from there we'll be ending this video. Actually, we have learned a lot. Yeah. And uh, just to ask you, uh, just ju just come here, Gidi. Kuja. Edson. 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 We want to end the video with Edson here. Uh, he wants to go back to church yeah. <laughs> because the mom, she's there. So we are just ending the video here with uh, Edson. And uh, he's very happy for the oh, big surprise that uh, he has uh, yeah. Uh, he has received today from America. Yeah. And uh, actually, your gift has come from America. Okay. So, as you grow, 
Just know that uh, you have already received from America the gift. The dogs are barking because they have seen the new face. Yeah. yeah. So as you grow, just know that you have already received a gift from America. Say thank you. Okay. Say thank okay, you. guys, I'm telling her, I'm telling him that way. Wakati unakuta jua kuwa wewe ulishapata zawadi kutoka Marekani, si ndio? Yeah. Aya, asante. Guys, we are ending the video here. Thank you very much. Uh, please remember to subscribe. This is the gate, but I know one day one time you are going to have a perimeter wall yeah. and you are going to have a pure a good that's gate. My, that's my dream. Yeah. But uh, I'm also praying just my gate is just an embarrassment but all the same. Things No, uh, at least you know this one, uh, at least it is uh you close when you are in you know. Yeah. For you to enter in you have to open something. Yeah. You strain, it's, you strain to close it's, it. It's, it's, huh? Yeah. It doesn't even move. Yes. It's so uh, you have to lift it up. Yeah. For you to close it. Yes. And it has got a footpath. Huh? Yeah. The smaller one. Yeah. That somebody I can pass. I tried to just improve it like that. Yeah. But with uh, as time goes by, uh, we are uh, just uh, wishing for where are wishers? They are all out there. Good people are out there. I yeah. know everything is just going to you know you know the way you have uh, tried your compound uh, everything is good. Yeah. You never knew that you will have all of this kind that you have. In fact, when we look back from where we come, you know yeah. this is my homeland. It's a journey. I was brought up where I was born in another county. Yes. We moved to this. But right now you are here. here. Even me, I'm here. Yes. And right now you, you stay. From very far. Yeah, very far. Yeah. And right now we have uh, yeah. been here. Yes. We have to develop this community. Yeah, it's all of God. Us. Yeah. It's all of this is the hand of God. It's the hand of God. So guys, over the other side there. I've been dormant because I've been taking care of this boy seriously. Yes. Yeah. And uh, I've been dormant in my YouTube channel has been dormant for a while yes. because he has been hospitalized for a number of days. Yes. Now, in fact, he came from the world some few day, like four days ago. I see when he's feeling yeah. some pain. So, so I've been away, yeah. but please, I have one sincere request to you. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's Manigidi One Doctor. I will so, be putting the link, guys, over yeah. this uh, video, yes. so that we can check out and subscribe. Yeah, uh, he's busy actually working on the boy. That's why sometimes he don't put by upload the video, but very soon he will start uploading friend, frequently. Who just give it to me that gift from USA? May God bless you abundantly. In fact, this is a matter of saving life. Okay. You have saved a life. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, guys. Wanna end the video? Bye bye. In fact, the camera is four percent. Yeah. Yeah. We have really uh, did a long video, but uh, bye bye. We shall meet in the next video. Remember to subscribe. Thank you. Thank you.